Hey, hello YouTube. I'm Kran from Media. And in this video, we're going to talk about the first 3D game in the batch programming. So, the name of, of the game is Blockout and it is a 3D version of the traditional Tetris game. So, the game uses three batch plugins out of which CMD GFX GDI .dx is created by Mizol101 and the CMD with .dx is also created by Mizol101 and the game itself is also created by Mizol101 so they are quite a great batch programmer and they have created everything they need for the creation of the project so here you can see the object file for the game so the compatibility of the game is quite amazing as in windows 10 we have a 3d builder application so if you will double click on the logo dot what's the extension of the game is dot object then you will see a 3d created interface and a 3d output inside the application so the compatible the game is quite compatible and using the standards of traditional programming so without any delay let's jump into the gameplay simply double click on the black blockout dot bat file and as you can see here the amazing output on the cmd console this kind of output in the 3d <laughs> interface in the game it seems to be impossible but Mizol 101 has achieved this kind of great output on the console so here you can see that everything you need to know to play the game is in front of you that press space to play and skip to quit here are cursor keys you can use the cursor keys to move and on your left hand side the key the keys z x and c are used to rotate x y and z of the character and you can use the space to drop the character directly so here you like in the traditional tetris you have to see the game from the one side but here you are seeing the game from top down from top to bottom so the game seems quite interesting now let's jump into the gameplay and simply press the space key and here you can see a box object is going to drop on the base of this 3d container so I'm going to move that and let me rotate it and here I'm gonna oops I have placed it wrong so as you can see it's a plain box so I'm gonna drop it pressing space and I all we need to do is just to fill the base and the base element will automatically get removed so here you can see I can fill that thing uh, let me try some hand on it uh, yeah let's press it oops I think I have missed something so uh, let me drop it almost kind of filled oops I think I have missed it and the game has become tough now because I don't have any space to put this box so I'm going to drop it on the top and here I'm moving the box using the arrow keys and rotating it by using my Z X and Y keys Z X and C keys so here you can see I'm not good at this game so but the game is quite challenging this is the challenge in the game 
so you need to complete the challenge in order to complete the game but i don't think i don't think so i can complete this so as you can see here as well as the game is creating the objects random object here you can see the temporary files created behind the scenario and here the files are automatically get deleted and created so that you can enjoy the game and i must say the creation is quite amazing and i hope you will like this game and feel free to comment and appreciate the work of mizol 101 so let me show you the code of the game first before ending the video and as you can see the blockout server version is, is created by Mikhail Solabon also known as Misol 101 MISOL 101 so <coughs> the name is taken from MI and SOL from the initials of their name and the game is quite amazing and you can see the code here and you can analyze the code by your own just download the game from the link given in the description thanks for watching feel free to appreciate the work of mizol 101 and please subscribe to my channel and share the videos with your friends see you soon bye bye